Welcome back to the channel guys and good morning. Crypto Lightsaber with another video. I want to talk about Baidao once again. Did do a video about Baidao yesterday. If you haven't seen that, you can go and check that out. Alright guys, and in that video we talked about the fact that Brian Condonenza, the CTO of Baidao, um, was speaking at the DeFi virtual conference of 2020. And if you haven't seen that, you can go and check that out on Bitcoin Events YouTube channel. Alright guys, um, it is a virtual conference, unfortunately, they're not standing up in a big room full of people talking on this occasion. But um, yeah, you can go and see that. If you want to see what Brian's got to contribute to that, you can go and check that out. All right, guys. And um, yeah, go check out my previous video for more information on that. All right. Now, the reason for this video this morning is when I did wake up, I decided to check out a few comments. All right. And I received this comment from uh, Mako or Marco. Um, hope I'm pronouncing that correctly so shout out to Mako or Marco um, in regards to this all right well he left me a comment saying for by now check out www.digitaleurope.org and look at the corporate member section you might like what you see all right so that interested me you know I thought might as well check it out all right got a bit of time on my hands now I get a lot of uh, uh, not a lot but I do get quite a few you know people saying check this out check that out you know, I have had, you know, something, you know, someone sent me an email before about Baidao um, in regards to something that I won't mention. And and sometimes I won't mention certain things only for the fact that there's no real evidence, uh, uh, you know. So it does, some things I do hear do sound really good, but I don't want to share you without the right evidence, factual evidence. All right, guys. So, um, yeah, just I'll just leave that one at that. But, yeah, with this one, we're looking at Digital Europe. Okay, now... This seems to be uh, well, it's well put together, the website, all right, guys, and uh, I don't know how new it is or how old it is. Copyright 2020, so it is quite new, all right? But it's the voice of digitally transforming industry. So I guess this is like, a, you know, um, an organization which brings, you know, um, like-minded business people or, or, or you know, um, Europeans together in regards to having a voice to transform the industry in Europe, I guess, digital Europe, you know. But um, we just read their initial statement, okay. Digital Europe is an international non-profit association whose membership includes 40 national trade associations from across Europe, as well as 76 corporations which are global leaders in their field of activity. In total, we re re we, in total, we represent over 35,000 businesses who operate and invest in Europe, all right? So let's just get to the meat and potatoes of this video, all right? So when you scroll down, like it says in the comment, uh, if you go to the corporate members part, okay, and that's right over here. So it says our membership, a network of strong partnerships across Europe and within its powerhouse Brussels. Our 76 corporate members are among the world's largest IT, telecoms, and consumer electronics companies and heavily invest in Europe. Our 40 national trade associations, associations represent 29 European countries. Our membership includes more than 35,000 businesses across the full ICT value chain and beyond. You know what? So, going straight to the corporate members. Uh, link okay, we've got 76 corporate members. All right, now if we look at some of the names here, we've got Essential, Airbus, Amazon, we all know Amazon, right? Apple, we all know Apple, right? And then amongst that, we've got Baidao. Okay, so this is definitely a great find. Shout out to Mako or Marco, like I said before. All right, so Baidao are here among names as usual, a name amongst names. All right, guys, and we've got you know more names, we've got Bosch. Bose, we've got brother, Canon, right? Huge names, guys. Dropbox, we all know Dropbox. Dell, Epson, Ericsson, Facebook, right? Google, Fujitsu, don't know that one. Hitachi, Hewlett Packard, Hewlett Packard again, right? HP, uh, well, that's Hewlett Packard Enterprise, all right? So it's probably, uh, yeah, uh, you know sister company or something intel huawei or huawei 
I don't know. Guys, I don't know how to pronounce this, all right? Is it Hawaii or Huawei, all right? HSBC. Who I bank with, by the way. Okay, HSBC. Lenovo, LG, MasterCard. Mitsubishi, Microsoft. Okay, NEC, Motorola. Nokia. Philips, Panasonic. Rico, Samsung. Sharp, Sony, Siemens, Siemens, Toshiba, Visa. A lot of guys and many of you might be watching in various parts of the world, you know, I only re really mention the ones that I know. I don't know Swatch Group, I don't know Technicolor, so, you know, some of you somewhere in the world might know what some of these other ones are, right guys, but I think there's plenty enough uh, big names in there for us to get excited about the fact that Baidao are listed amongst these names all right guys and that seems to be a common theme right now we're seeing a lot of these conferences with a lot of invites for you know some household names and then Baidao is thrown in the midst of them all right and uh you know for us we obviously know what Baidao is a lot of people out there might look at it like you know like 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 me where I don't know what AMD is and they might look at this and they think oh I know who Apple is don't know that one Baidao you know what I mean but we fortunately do all right guys and we've got a chance to invest in this at very early stage all right in the ico phase okay before it's launched to the general public yet all right guys so we are in a great position to be able to purchase buy down not a financial advisor please do your own research of course but um yeah buy down to me is quickly becoming <laughs> even more exciting as, as as each day goes by all right guys yeah this is a, a great find from marco or mako and um yeah definitely want to watch by definitely at ico it's got a lot of people excited and let's hope that we uh made lots of money with this one guys all right uh yeah so that's about it just wanted to share that with you um it's always good to have people sharing stuff all right guys and if you do share me news that i do find interesting i will be happy to share it on the channel all right guys so keep it coming shout out to marco once again or Marco, sorry and uh yeah that's it for now if you're not subscribed to the channel please do me a favor and do that all right leave a like leave a comment down below are you excited about buy or do you still think it's a scam